Hey guys, so here are Stu Anthony review the Stu Bum Lego Blake Army uh, Rhino Heavy Armored Car. So this is the box here. Uh, so you can see it's recommended for just six and up, and uh, comes with 151 pieces. And this set uh, B 0587C. And um, yeah, so this is the top, the bottom, the side and the other side and the back shows you the full uh, set there and that you can uh, collect all of them and uh, make it into uh, these one of these uh, vehicles and yeah I almost uh, f finished all the collection except for this one I haven't reviewed this one and this one but yeah I already got this one and yeah of course this one too so yeah uh, let's get into the instructions so this is the instruction manual and yeah nothing so special and you know the instruction is you know pretty clear and yeah it's uh, very short too but yeah so that's it for the instruction so these are the extra pieces and there is also uh, extra stickers for for the set uh, for like other sets uh, in this uh, Mio army line and yeah uh just some extra stickers nice to get them i guess but yeah the extra pieces they are very generous you know you got stud your extra arm the crit for the uh tank crits and you know uh technic axle piece um these uh modified piece a uh, half a brick and one of these brick with this uh top here well, uh, and yeah, you also got uh, some plates, uh, tiles here, uh, you got this uh, slope, and finally this uh, clip piece. So yeah, uh, pretty nice extra pieces. So this is the Griver minifigure that is in this set. And yeah, as you can see, he comes with a really cool uh, helmet. And if you remove it, uh, you have his uh, nice face with a little bit of a scratch there which is uh, kind of a bit bad but you know you guys armor here and yeah uh, it's just the same armor piece that is in the whole uh, set and yeah so let's remove the armor so this is uh, his torso printing under the armor so yeah that's it for the figure so this is the uh, Rhino Heavy Armored Car here and you know the real life one actually has uh, wheels not these uh, tank crits uh, so I'll assume uh, this is a uh, kind of different variant of it maybe I'm not sure but uh, yeah so the front here uh, this front part is connected by this only this clip piece on the, uh, the jumper plate which is a little bit uh, not not so well connected so you know that's uh, kind of bad but yeah you got the m38 uh, sticker there and you also got some headlights and yeah this whole thing is a uh, ratcheted so you know you can open it up and inside there's nothing maybe you can put in some uh, some people in there and you know some troops or you know just something like that i guess and you know, kind of a bit sad that they didn't use out the hollow space inside, but yeah. So the top here got this uh main main turret or main cannon here, which uh you can you can't really uh, spin it. You can only aim it up and down, and you can put the pilot figure or the driver figure on top here to uh, man the turret or the gun, and yeah. Um. So here uh, you got this uh, towel piece with this sticker here and here you got this little antenna which is a really nice piece and the back is uh, you know looks okay and you know like aside from that that's uh, really not much else to this thing I mean you have, you have this like two sticker to this thing and also on this on this side too and yeah I mean the the crits they move well but uh they move well only in the in more like a soft uh, surface like a sofa or something like or like a bit uh, so yeah but you know it's quite nice to get uh, these crits and yeah they're in black too so yeah uh, that's uh, really it for the build 
so overall conclusion of this set so how do I think of it uh well it's um well the main figure is uh nothing it's just the same main figure as all the other figure in the the set and the build I mean like uh you know, on the outside it looks pretty good, and you know, uh, nice that the crits uh, work as well. And uh, you know, but it's just that the inside was hollow, and you know, maybe they could have uh, used up uh, the space inside. So yeah, but uh, you know, like the build itself is uh, really great, and yeah. So overall, I do recommend you getting the full set because like it's a really cool army. Uh, collector set I guess but yeah uh, so buying to the full set down in the description box below along with all of my social media pages down in the description so if you want to get physical alternative bricks I'll put a link down in the description box below as well but thanks for watching I'll see you very soon